learning everybody so today guys it's going to be a different kind of day today guys we are on day three of our repurposing project guys downstairs we gotta start assembling things to make things look good yeah, buddy. All right, guys. So without further ado, let's go ahead, get our tools, get our glue, and let's head on down to the basement so we can get this project started. I decided to go with the one cube. And the reason being is because it's too much of a risk. I don't want to risk the cube falling on one of my children. Although you guys suggested brackets, I'm still not comfortable with this. I'm still not comfortable with having them on top of one another. Even if I switched it around and put the white one on top of the brown one, I just do not want to take the risk of Samuel or Haley or any one of my children bumping up against it and then it just collapsing. That will mess me up to no end. So no, 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 I'm gonna stick to uh, the one level and uh, I'm gonna make it work. Say that again. What bit would you use to drill a hole? So he said he's going to ask me a technical would question. Would you use this one? Which bit? Of course not. Yeah, you would. No, you. I wouldn't. I would use... I already did it. I would either use this Why one... Why that's so big? Or this one. Okay. Let's see. Uh. There you go. Measure. Yep. Perfect. Uh, no, that's too big. Not really. That's no, too big. No, you know we have more. I know. Oh, here you go. We got a thousand of them. This one. Let's see that. Actually, I did this yesterday. I was like, let me come down here just in case he mm. won't be able to assist. Are we trying to drill in places where there is no previous hole? No, we're drilling where the hole is, okay. but we're drilling from on top of here. Okay. So. But I figured we would probably do that to make it a little bit more sturdy. I'll, you see, it's just real wobbly. Yeah, but I don't want to add any more holes mm. to this. Mm. This is pressed cardboard. Okay. Yeah. Let's see. Yep. Okay. Yep. Right in. All right. We, we probably shouldn't have moved it. We got to because we got to measure this one. You just can't no. go from here, like measure from here to here and then zip. No, this should be an inch and a half. Oh. But like you said now, since we got what we had, since we have what we have, we're going to have to measure from here to here right, now. Right, right, to make it easier. That yep, we because have. we got a lip on the front of that. So you see where the nine is written? Mm -hmm. So I know, okay, it's right there. It's right where the, right under where the nine is written. Okay, so you wanna put a mark right there? No, uh, I know, okay, I'm gonna mark good it okay. Here. okay. So let's get this back to where we want it. Mm -hmm.
can see the house is scurrying around. All right, Haley is up. Uh, here, I found quite a few of them. There you go, you uh, have it. So we're not gonna take them all right now. Okay. Yeah. A purple one. Purple. And you can have a. I thought you said they were all. Different. I didn't know. I didn't realize they were all different colors. Here, you got a green one. So we can save these for later. Okay? Um, I don't want the green one. Which one you want? The pink one. Yeah, I want this one. That's the purple one. I want this one. Too. You already have a pink one. Let's see, do you? No, that's purple. That's purple. All right, let's take the green one back. All right. <laughs> so this is my arts and crafts section, guys, in my basement, and practically everything in here, um, were dumpster diving finds. And I, as you can see, I try organize it, organizing them as best as I could. Got my markers, my decorations, my craft tools, pens, and crafting supplies there. You know, you got to make way and make do what we have. I don't have a fancy schmancy crafting section, but this will do. Look, I have my glues and my sticky stuff, all my adhesives in here. And then right there, my construction paper, you know. I actually am proud of my little self for making this this possible. Then over here we have our paints, then we have our corks, and then we have our flowers. And what's in here? I don't know what's in here. Oh, we have some um, lights just in case, you know, want to decorate something. So, yeah, this is my little crafting section right here, guys. Mm -hmm. Uh, yep. So everything is definitely being utilized. This is stuff that we use from other projects. As we, you know, get the house done, we keep all the material and just use it for different projects like this. All the plastic. Okay. Yeah, I'll remove it. I don't want to. You want to do it now? Down. Okay. okay. I don't think that it would have mattered, but I guess you're right. If it was nailed down, the plastic could stick up under the... Yeah, and then you'll be trying to stain it. All right, we probably need some scissors. For mm -hmm. this part right here, this stuck right here. Okay. So you get some scissors, so you won't have to lift it. No, I'm not going to lift it. Do you have scissors? My, the cutter, the, the box cutters are good. So here it is, stage one. So now I got to take a few moments to see how I am going to finish this up. I saw one um, YouTuber, actually no, Instagrammer who attached doors to hers, which I thought was great. And then I saw another one with, as you did see, with the glass. So possibilities are endless here. 
It's a lot of different ways I can do this. Oh, we gotta put the thing on the back. Now that everything is attached, the pegs right here are sticking out. And what I don't want is whatever it is that I do to the to the organizer, it causes it to be off because of that. That's not causing it to be off by a few inches. That's just causing that to be sticking out and not be right. That's all. But is Lift it, it back up? All right, we're gonna go ahead and fix it so it can be right because that would drive me crazy. Now, you run the risk of having to put it have to put it all back together. That's the thing. We run the so risk of putting it back the together. That then you, you that if you pull this apart and then you do something and it starts to you do run the risk. So it's up to you how you wanna how you wanna assess your risk. But then I'm thinking about the other risk fa factor. If we you with these you can't keep unscrewing the screw because then it'll cause it to not be as firm. The grip will be a little bit loose. I mean, we could try it. I mean, what what you got to lose? <laughs> what you mean? It ain't it ain't worth nothing. Well, it is worth something because I'm putting my time into yeah. it. Yeah, you, but you choose where you want to put your time. What I'm saying is, what it, you want to do? Is the juice worth the squeeze? Because it, it, either way it go, don't matter to me. It does look a little crooked, but whatever. <laughs> See what I'm saying? Uh-uh. Let's do it. You swing you that? No, it's crooked. All right, we gotta do it over. We got we got to fix that. Right, got it to. does. <laughs> Come on. It does. We got to do it then. Once you said that, that means it's obvious. No way. All right, but we got to get that together. Mm -hmm. Well, just to be on the safe side, can no, we just put a little bit more glue, like just yeah, right yeah. here? I just need you. To Hold on, wait a minute. Come on, let's just attach this right. Let's focus on that. A, there it goes. Wait. Wait, because you got this one. They got to go in at the same time. Okay, ready? There it goes. Go. Okay, push it in. Let me look underneath to make sure we don't have any more. That's out. I would hate for us to have to do this over. All right. It appears to be ready ready to go buddy no but won't you just stick like put a line strip of glue why are you like that that's not what's holding it though the screws are holding it right but if you put glue here wouldn't okay. it i'm just saying <laughs> no, I, listen no, i don't know i'm not handy like that i don't know <laughs> okay if you want to waste glue let's go for it <laughs> that's what you want to do i don't want to just waste glue i just want to make sure it's gonna stay Okay. Why don't we just glue it together? <laughs> That's not going to work. No, these holes were pretty good. Yeah, you did a great yeah, job. I'm they impressed. Actually, they actually made it. I uh, thought they were off. No, nope, I'm impressed. You did a great see, job measuring me. You don't see me. no extra holes. It would have been all off messing with me. You, you could have just glued it together. No. <laughs> Shut up. Here, baby. Right here. Oh, I missed the glue spot. What? <laughs> He was irritating. <laughs> so here she is she is pretty i am liking it so far guys um i absolutely love it i'm just ready now to style her she's so pretty we're gonna make this our top instead of the bottom um someone suggested that i put some nail wood wood putty right here um i gotta see if i can find some and then you know, sand it out so it can be an even board up there. But I, I am very impressed. I am very impressed. So far, so good. Now it's again, it's time to style her and um, beautify her. I don't know if I want to put doors. I don't know if I want to use the glass that I saw in the other video. I don't know. 
your input is definitely appreciated. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for part four.